Hi, welcome back. I'm Kathy, and if you're new to my channel, I do food and product reviews. And you might remember the other day, last week, days are getting confusing to me. I did a video on crazy cakes. Super simple cake. Don't need milk, eggs, or butter. Uh, I will link that video here. But I got a comment from Andy C saying she had a depression pie recipe that I should try. It is a fake apple pie. It doesn't take any apples. It Ritz crackers. I'd never heard of it, but then Don W commented. You might know him. He is um, the channel's poet. Uh, down below, I pin all of his poems. Um, check them out. But he said that he had it as a kid and um, that it used to be on the back of the Ritz cracker box. I'd never heard of this before in my life, uh, but I went to Pinterest and there was all kinds of recipes for it. So I don't know if I've been living under a rock. I don't know. It is no longer on the Ritz cracker box, but I guess it's been around since like 1930. So this is so weird to me. You know, Ritz crackers do not taste like apples. Um, so um, I'm kind of excited to try it. I can't really believe. I don't really think it's gonna taste like an apple pie, but I'm willing to give it a try. But it's a super simple recipe, so I'll be open-minded, I will give it a try. So the one I found on Pinterest was very similar to the one that Andy sent me, uh, but I'll link it below. It's from plainchicken.com, I believe. Um, so yeah, so let's get started. Okay, so you start with two cups of water, some medium high heat, a cup of sugar, which thankfully I was able to find some sugar at the store two teaspoons of cream of tartar. Just gonna stir this up and let it come to a boil. Once it comes to a boil, I'm gonna add in my Ritz crackers. This calls for 36 crackers. Uh, I believe there's 32 in one sleeve, so I have a few extra and I'm gonna put them in whole. So once it comes to a boil, I will add in the crackers. Okay, so it started to boil. I'm gonna add in the crackers, whole crackers. I've seen some recipes where they're, uh, where you crush them up, but this is so bizarre to me. I feel like it's just gonna be mushy crackers. So I let this boil for five minutes. I'm not sure about this. We'll see. Okay, while that's boiling, I'm gonna make the topping. So it is a cup of crackers crushed up, a half a cup of brown sugar, a teaspoon of cinnamon. I'm sorry, a half a teaspoon of cinnamon, and a half a cup of butter. I have also seen recipes where you could just uh, use another pie crust uh, for the top if you like. But I like a, I like the topping. It looks pretty good. Okay, so a little frustrated right now. I thought I'd hit record and I didn't when I was pouring the apples, crackers, into the pan. Okay, so I'm making another one, but for the topping, I'm short some crackers. I didn't have enough. I would've gone to the store, but the cracker aisle is pretty empty right now. So I did have some, some townhouse crackers, so I'm just using that for the topping. Um, but I was still sh a little short there too. I just kind of want to show you what the crackers look like uh, when I'm pouring them into the uh, the pie. So, just about ready. I will hit record this time. Okay, as you can see, kind of see. All right, I'm gonna pour it into the pan. It kind of smells or looks apple-y. It's very weird. All right. So to this, I'm gonna sprinkle over a okay, half a teaspoon of cinnamon. And a tablespoon of lemon juice. Right. The topping isn't quite the same, but, um, but um, I'll see, I'm gonna give it a try anyway. So it's been 10 minutes, and now very carefully, just 
going to cover the edge and bake at 350 for another 18 to 20 minutes. It really smells amazing. So, this is so crazy to me. Oops. Okay, so back in for another 18 minutes until it, ah, it sets up. Let me see. It's jiggly right now. Okay, back in the oven. All right, so here it is, the wannabe apple pie. It, um, it's kind of crazy, but it does look like an apple pie. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna try it without the ice cream first. So weird. And I still can't believe I uh, forgot to hit record. But... All right. Let's see, let me just get some of the apple. Yeah, it kind of does. It almost kind of tastes like a apple pie that's overcooked, or where the where the uh, apples are a little mushy. Um, but it's really good. But yeah, so whoever thought of this is kind of a genius, because uh, I can tell you a box of Ritz crackers are uh, cheaper than apples. So I'm gonna try the ice cream. I like the topping a lot. I think I would like that better without. Um, I know, like I said, you can make it with just another pie crust. But I like the crunch of the topping. Um, no. Can you really go wrong with ice cream and caramel syrup? It's not too sweet. Um, the topping is a little sweeter. The topping does add more of the sweetness than the pie itself. It's actually really good and I'm like very surprised. I'm not sure where it's been all my life, but really hard. This will all be over. But thank you to, thank you Andy for um, recommending this recipe. I give it um, a double, a double thumbs up. So if you've ever had this, let me know. Am I just the only one who's never heard of this? Uh, it's kind of crazy. But yeah, really good. I'm gonna stop now. All right, yeah, so if you tried it, let me know in the comments below. I'm curious if I have just been living under a rock. Uh, so yeah, let me know. So that brings me to the question of the day. The question, question is from uh, a diary of a plant killer wants to know if I had to be stuck in one place, one location for 24 hours, where would it be? It's a hard question because I have a lot of questions about this question. Is a location your house? Can I be stuck in my house for 24 hours? I've been stuck in my house for many, many hours. Um, or is it one room in your house? I don't know. If it had to be one room in my house, I guess I would have to say bathroom kind of gross but my bathroom's clean um yeah so I don't know um diary of a plant killer if you would like to elaborate on that question uh, feel free and I will answer it again but I wasn't sure how to take that but yeah so if it was one location one room it would be my bathroom I think we all know why all right so let me know below in the comments where is one location if you had to be stuck 24 hours, where would it be? Let me know in the comments below. And again, if you try the pie, the wannabe apple pie, let me know in the comments below. All right, thanks for watching. Have a great day, and I will see you next time. Hopefully, it will be a little quieter. Anyway, have a good day. Bye.